used to. We'll see. set everything up to bring them this way so they don't appear to like our drone so I'm gonna do uh, our drone shots first I won't be able to show them filing through the system but you get to see what we've got set up and then I'm gonna take the drone and fly out to them instead of riding a horse So we may have to do a little bit of both, the drone and us, to get them in here. Come here. All right, so the way we got it set up, they're gonna come around here, head towards the barn, turn into the alley. I need to open the bud box up now. They'll come up this way, turn into the alley, our original plan was to let them also have that while we close this gate. I don't really care. Um, probably wouldn't hurt anything. That's not good. All of a sudden it misses the other side of that latch. See that? And we tested that earlier. No? All right, so for now I'm gonna pin this open just in case they wanna go this way. open the bud box up so we will be able to pull that gate in close behind them so we'll open the bud box up man gates closed I do not want this permanent tied to this fence but I don't want it to swing shut before I want it closed so I'm just gonna do this real quick. All right, we're sending cattle this way. Let me go get the drone. You guys stay there. Um, so 
So we're gonna walk over there towards the uh, pump so that hopefully they're heading this way towards the barn. And then we'll follow them up and deal with it as we go. Everything nice and steady. We'll get the drone in the air. Take some quick drone footage for you. pretty straightforward read the instructions watched their videos so we'll get it loaded now <coughs> hi girl they are in the bud box but I do not have the bud box closed yeah I know I agree that's how life works sometimes, though. I think one time or another, we're all in the bud box, right? Yes, no, maybe, manana, oh, cool. Okay, so this is ready to go. Set it in its case. Everything else is ready to go. So let's see how well this works. Now my problem is going to be... <clears throat> you guys have never done this before. 
I've got to get them in that squeeze chute and be up here to time the catch while also pressuring them. And did you guys watch the videos we showed you about their flight zone and how to approach them and just get them moving without running them? See, it'd be good if you actually did your homework. Well, you had homework. So this is just closed when we, when we release them. Otherwise, I'm not used to even having this. Normally, we just let them out wherever we're working. And they go stand in the corner. They don't, they don't bother you. So. so what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk out there. And I'm going to try to get them to calmly come around me into the bud box. I'm going to get them in the bud box. I'm going to calmly get them to come up the head chute. The squeeze chute is closed. It means that they can't go through it right now. <clears throat> come here and lay down. So I need just something to touch them with. Give me the one that has a whippy end on it. Probably could have just tied a grocery bag to it. <clears throat> just something if I need. Otherwise, if I do this right, I shouldn't have to make a sound. I shouldn't have to touch them with anything. Don't need to shock them. They're just going to flow right into what we want to do. They're going to have some little setbacks. It's going to get loud and bang. Take the dogs over there. Jaden, take the dogs over there. Come here. Come here. Stay with Jaden. Stay with Jaden. Lay down. Stay with Jaden. All right. I'm going to walk in here and I'm just going to try to move them around. It's our first time using our cattle handling system in our bud box. It's the first time our cattle have gone through any handling. So we're going to try to take this slow and steady. And hopefully this goes to plan. They're all behind you right now. You want to swing around and take a look? They're curious. Everybody's calmed down. And we're eating a little. So all we're doing today is we've got to castrate our, our number one, our bull, first born on this farm. And everybody else just getting a little bit of regular fly spray no other medications or treatments. So number one's getting castrated, which also means he gets a tetanus shot. So let's see how this goes. <coughs> for the purpose of this, the mic may cut off, but I want the cameraman to stay inside the gates for now. Camera down, drop it on the ground right now. Uh, stands.
right there. Stand still. You're, I want you, don't look at anything but that green gate. I want you to take another step forward. Take another step forward towards the green gate where the green gate and the wooden gate meet on the far side is where I want you just slowly walking towards. Slowly, keep walking. A little bit faster, walk. Keep walking towards that green gate, look right in their eyes. Yep, lay your hand on the gate. Stand still. Walk along that fence towards the hinges. Now, this is going to be magic. Walk towards me, following the green gate. Keep your hand out. Look them right in the eye. Now walk along that wooden gate towards the other green gate. Tell him. Make a kiss sound. Tell him. Now walk straight towards that green gate. Keep walking. Keep walking straight towards the green gate. Make a kiss sound. Now walk up down the green gate towards the wooden fence. You're just going to keep walking that clockwise box. Walk along that wooden fence. Go down that wooden fence. They're getting used to it finally. Everybody's calming down a little. Turn towards the back wooden fence. Make a little bit smaller box. Make a kissing sound. Now back up. Walk forward. Back up. Walk towards your button and back up. Come to this fence. Now stand still, now back up. Don't worry about it, just keep walking. This could prove interesting. If keep walking. Touch him. Touch him on the butt. I'm going to walk down this fence line right by their ears. Hold it. Slow. I don't want them running at this point. Start walking again down this fence line right by their ears. Touch her on the butt gentle. Touch her on the butt gentle. I wish I was separating them. Stand still. Touch her on the butt, gentle. Keep walking the fence line slow. Touch her on the butt. Touch him on the butt. Miles, smack at him. All right, everybody stand still. Everybody stand still. I'm going to walk it up. Nothing, stay back. Huh? Stop. Miles, come here. See this tail? Yeah. Hold that tail with force. That's what's up. That's what's keeping him from kicking. Okay?
the dosage. Touch his head. Yes. Ouch. I know. Melinda, you want to pet him? I already Alright, get out of there, guys. Shut this. Yeah, you can. Stand still. bit of the video you didn't get to see you'll notice that uh, we have a little oopsie we want to uh, make this a solid wood alleyway but uh, one of the steer our crazy new steer one of the crazy young steers started a mass exodus under the gate panel yesterday so after that we had a couple cows crawl under but you saw the rest we got junior we did everything number one that we wanted to do definitely gonna have to build that as a solid wood alleyway but we got her done 